Gospel of Thomas 140 to 170 AD. The Gospel of Thomas was discovered in Nag Hammadi, Egypt in 1945. The following is a fresh translation made from the Coptic text published by Messrs. Brill of Leiden. In the preparation of these verses, the following six translations have been consulted in addition to being published by Messrs. Brill. English by W. R. Chaudel, French by Dorsey and R. Kosser, German by J. Lipalt and Hans Koike, Danish by S. Giberson. The numbering of the sayings is that of the Brill edition. The name Yahshua was restored by Yaakov. These are the secret words which the living son Yahshua spoke, and Didymus, Judas Thomas, wrote them down. And he said, He who shall find the interpretation of the words shall not taste of death. Yahshua said, He who seeks, let him not cease seeking until finds, and when he finds, he will be troubled. And if he is troubled, he will be amazed, and he will reign over the all. Yahshua said, If those who lead you say unto you, Behold, the kingdom is in heaven, then the birds of the heaven will be before you. If they say unto you, It is in the sea, then the fish will be before you. But the kingdom is within you, and it is outside of you. When you know yourselves, then shall you be known, and you shall know that you are the sons of the living Father. But if ye do not know yourselves, then you are in poverty, and you are poverty. Yoshua said, The man age in his days will not hesitate to ask a little child of seven days about the place of life, and he shall live. For there are many first who shall be last, and they shall become a single one. Yoshua said, Know what is before thy face. And what hidden from thee shall be revealed unto thee? For there is nothing hidden which shall not be made manifest. His disciples asked him and said unto him, Wilt thou that we fast? And how shall we pray? Shall we give alms? And what rule shall we observe in eating? Yoshua said, Do not lie, and that which you hate do not do. For all things are revealed before heaven, for there is nothing hidden which shall not be manifest, and there is nothing covered which shall remain without being uncovered. Yahshua said, Blessed is the lion which the man shall eat, and the lion become man. And cursed is the man whom the lion shall eat, and the lion become man. And he said, Man is like a wise fisherman who cast his net into the sea and drew it, up from the sea full of small fish. Among them the wise fisherman found a large, great fish. He threw down all the small fish into the sea. He chose the large fish without trouble. He that hath ears to hear, let him hear. Yahshua said, Behold, the sower went forth, he filled his hand, he cast. Some fell upon the road. The birds came and gathered them. Others fell on the rock and sent no root down to the earth nor did they sprout any ear up to heaven. And others fell on the thorns, they choked the seed, and the worm ate them. And others fell on this earth, and brought forth righteous fruit unto heaven, some sixtyfold, and some a hundred and twentyfold. Yahshua said, I have cast fire upon the world, and behold, I guard it until it is ablaze. Yahshua said, This heaven shall pass away, and that which above it shall pass away. And they that are dead are not alive, and they that live shall not die. In the days when you are eating that which is dead, you are making it alive. When you come in the light, what will you do? On the day when you were one, you became two. But when you have become two, what will you do? The disciples said to Yahshua, We know that thou wilt go from us. Who is he who shall be great over us? Yahshua said to them, In the place to which you come, you shall go to Yaakov the righteous, for whose sake heaven and earth came into being. Yahshua said to the disciples, Make a comparison to me, and tell me whom I am like. Simon Peter said to him, Thou art like a righteous Malik, angel. Matthew said to him, Thou art like a wise man of understanding. Thomas said to him, 
Master, my mouth will no wise suffer that I say whom thou art like. Yosho said, I am not thy teacher, because thou hast drunk. Thou hast become drunk from the bubbling spring, which I have measured out. And he took him, went aside, and spoke to him three words. Now when Thomas came to his companions, they asked him, What did Yoshua say to, unto thee? Thomas said to them, If I tell you one of the words which he said to me, you will take up stones and throw them at me, and a fire will come out of the stones and burn you up. Yoshua said to them, if you fast, you will beget a sin for yourselves, and if you pray, you will be condemned, and if you give alms, you will do an evil to your spirits, and if you go into any land and travel in its regions, if they receive you, eat what they set before you, heal the sick among them, for that which goes into your mouth will not defile you, but that which comes forth from your mouth, that is what will defile you. Yahushua said, When you see him who is not born of woman, Throw yourselves down upon your face and worship him. He is your father. Yoshua said, Perhaps men think that I am come to cast peace upon the world. And no, not that I am come to cast divisions upon the earth, fire, sword, war. For there shall be five in a house. There shall be three against two and two against three. The father against the son and the son against the father. And they shall stand as solitaries. Yoshua said, I will give you that which I have not seen, and ear has not heard, and hand has not touched, and which has not entered into the heart of man. The disciples said to Yoshua, Tell us how our end shall be. Yoshua said, Have you then discovered the beginning that you seek after the end? For where the beginning is, there shall the end be. Blessed is he who shall stand in the beginning, and he shall know the end, and shall not taste of death. Yoshua said, Blessed is he who was before he came into being. If you become my disciples and hear my words, these stones shall minister unto you. For you have five trees in paradise, which do not move in summer or in winter, and their leaves do not fall. He who knows them shall not taste of death. The disciple said to Yoshua, Tell us what the kingdom of heaven is like. He said to them, It is like a grain of mustard seed, smaller than all seeds, but when it falls on the earth, which is tilled, it puts forth a great branch and becomes shelter for the birds of heaven.